Canada's Transportation Safety Board has announced they will be probing the circumstances of the catastrophic implosion of the Titan sub, which has led to some complaints about how much this is costing us. It's a sub owned by a US company, it was in international waters, and the victims are American and British. And it's not like this is a mystery. The submersible was recklessly designed in almost every way. But the Titan was deployed from a Canadian flag vessel that left from a Canadian port. Also, the whole point of the Transportation Safety Board is to investigate accidents and recommend ways for them to not happen again. For instance, in the 1990s, they found that people kept dying in seaplane crashes because they were just wearing lap belts. The result? Now they've all got three-point seatbelts and more people are walking away from seaplane crashes with their spines intact. So hey, maybe the Transportation Safety Board will recommend that we don't let Canadian flagged vessels launch uncertified submersibles that then need to be rescued by our Coast Guard. This seems like a valuable use of government resources.